videotape this, so you'll hear me talking. We're just going to go ahead and section the tooth. A lot of, lot of noise here going through the crown. And if you obviously feel anything, just kind of, we got, we got our peepers going. We'll make sure that we stop and usually don't have any issue when we're cutting through the crown. You've got to cut a root canal down the tooth and the nerve's no longer there. Alright, let me have that. Crown is off. Tony, do you want the crown? Okay. All right, let me have. Uh... All right. Go, Karen. Thank you. section right there. Alright. Right. Looking good still. Alright, just gonna section the tooth in a couple different pieces here. So, can I have you just turn to your left just a little for me a little? Thank you. Alright. Good deal. Okay. A little bit of pressure. This tooth is probably already fractured, so you hear you hear a little bit of noise. But if you feel anything other than pressure, you gotta just let me know. You just moan at me or wiggle your hands or whatever. Straight peritone, please. This is where patience comes in. We want to preserve all the bone that we can, so by just kind of doing this slow and easy, we uh, help preserve the bone around the around the tooth that we're taking out. You can see here now we've got a couple millimeters between the mesial and distal portion of the tooth. That's really good. Now we're just trying to get that blood clot to form around the socket. Okay, force it please. Alright, hold on a second Karen. Alright now, get in there please. 
please. Take this now, please. Thank you. Right, I'm gonna try to push down. See if I can't get something else to grab. And now. Yeah, this tooth is just fractured a number of different pieces. There we go. Beautiful. All right, wonderful. Yeah, I may have to go to the needle nose. Praise the Lord. All right, good deal. Let me have a curette, please. Tooth is out. Okay, so really just everything expect as we expected. So let me let me have you just turn to your left there for me, just to. There you go. Thanks. So. Um, So we got a nice little. Uh, yes, please. Suction on that. Thank you. Yeah, this is one sick little tooth. And all we're cleaning out right now is just all that granulation tissue that was. I'm just trying to. Figure out what's going on with the bone and this infection and all right. And we can see here our communication and the loss of bone is what I'm really concerned about. As to whether or not you put an implant in today or you wait. And that's what we're analyzing right now as we're cleaning all this soft tissue up. Ferdatsum. Thank you. Curette. Thank you. We've got a good amount of bone loss here on the buckle. Um, all right, a little bit more. So, and then get rid of some excess soft tissue here that the actual instrument isn't doing like it should. Yes. Can you turn your head to your left just a tad? Thank you so much. Awesome. Thank you very, very much. So we definitely want to start this wrap phenomenon here and just get his body to start healing. Get rid of all this granulation soft tissue. Get rid of all this infection.
So, Dr. Joseph, I am going to be pragmatic here, and uh, I am not going to put our implant in today. We're going to just graft because this soft tissue out here and this little hole is going to prevent things from healing properly. Plus, you've lost probably four or five millimeters of bone on the outside of this tooth, mm -hmm. and where the bone is on the inside, we'd have to bury the implant so far that that would create a, a problem with the implant long term. Mm. So we've got good solid bleeding. So what we're going to do now is just go ahead and we'll put our graft in. So uh, let's go ahead and have a 14, please. Thank you. Section there you go. Good. Excellent. Thank you. Hi, Karen. Can you see in there okay? All right, good. So we're going to use a 50-50 mix of a cortical cancellous mineralized bone graft. And blot, please. Push that down in there. It's got mixed with platelet-rich plasma that we drew prior to starting the procedure. And then we will put a PRF plug over top of this that we created from our blood draw as well. Let me have the Woodson one, please. Thank you. Of the uh, number nine. Thank you. And blot. Okie dokie. All right. All right, Miss Karen. Yep. Blot again, please. Okay. Now, let me have that 14 back, please. Thank you. All right, now we'll go ahead and put our PRF plug over top of this. Beautiful. And then we'll compress this, and then we'll suture it up. Go ahead and take that, please. Thank you. All right, wonderful. that blade right there and cut that right above my there you go thank you and let me have the Woodson one thank you all right perfect oh it looks gorgeous all right Real gentle right there. Perfect. There you go. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Mm-hmm. 
that mirror out of the way for me as best you can okay I know it's not easy I'm gonna go ahead and take it just cuz I'm right there Don't pull up on this, okay? Got it? Yep, don't bring it to me. Don't pull up on it. Please, thank you. Beautiful. Good job. Excellent to me today. Alright, it was good. We could have done right there. All right, now let's grab our mirror. Grab that mirror, please. All right, now if you can blot for me gently. Okay. All right. So now we've got our crisscross suture all right over top of that. That looks absolutely gorgeous. Now we just got to let him heal for four months. So, all right, my friend, good job.